Hey, what is up guys? So, today, well first off, I'm going to explain why this video is going to be so long. So, I basically got a message from YouTube telling me I can now have videos longer than 20 minutes only for this channel. Like, I know most of you probably don't have it. I know I do, obviously. So that is why this video is going to be very long. Um, so yeah, right now I'm basically adjusting my tripod. Alrighty. Basically just sort of dropped it off. Okay. Alright. So I'm going to be reviewing all the colors that I have and if I like them. And this is because I feel like it. LOL. Okay, so I'm going to start off with this. Lime green. This color was my first color I ever had. Um, I love this color to death. It's not my favorite, but I just love it so much because it was my first color. And that's pretty big because I've had like over 90 rolls of tape. And as you can see, I have two rolls. Okay, so that's first. Then, well, actually I'm going to be doing all the colors first. Which I will be getting them out right now. Alrighty. It's going to end up a huge tower blocking my face. But I don't really care because it's not like you guys have to see my face Unless you're really some stalker. Which I hope you are not. Okay. I almost have them all. Okay, now I am putting them all out. Okay. Alright, so now I have all my colors. So now, I'm just going to move them over. Okay. I'll put that right there. Aw. Sorry, they just fell. Okay, so I'm just going to go with clear. This is not duck brand. It is scotch brand. It is clear tape. Um, I love it. I don't know about you, but I love it. It's amazing. I've never made a clear wallet or a um, but this color is pretty nice. Then you have OD Green. I have a lot to say about this color. I am the only person on YouTube with this color. I am not telling you where to get it. But you can buy a wallet from it and take it apart. And um, use the tape. So yeah, buy a wallet from this. That, that tape's amazing. It's military green. Next, I have brown, which is mud puddle. Um, this color is pretty, pretty nice. I use it a lot for making domo wallets. I haven't really showed you guys one yet, but sorry about that. I don't care though. Next, I have purple, my favorite color. Well, like my favorite like color, but not my favorite color of tape. But this is my favorite color. I love purple. Why wouldn't you like purple? Okay, moving on. I have light blue and teal. You can't really tell the difference, but right here is light blue or electric blue, whatever you want to call it. This color is nice for making like sky designs like on a wallet. So I would prefer buying a wallet from this. A lot of people make wallets with this. Mine are really nice. Um, or you could get a bracelet, too. This looks extremely good in a bracelet. Okay. Now I have teal. Um, it's like a green, it's like a darker version of light blue. Um, very nice. As you can see, I have a lot. Um, but it doesn't matter about how much I have. You can buy any color you want. I, I can just go out and buy another roll. That's what I spend your money on. Tape. And, like... 
Yeah, so please buy a wallet with that color. Then I have dark green. I'm sort of low on it. Well, I consider almost everything low. I'm pretty low on this. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Dark green. Pretty nice. I give it a 9 out of 10 if I was to vote. Now a red. Reds? I think like my second or third color I had. I love this color. Red and purple. They don't really go good together, but I love them. I love them. Oh, my tape fell. Okay, I'm just going to throw the rolls that I already looked over. I'm going to throw them into my basket. The next I have black. Or, yeah, we'll just do black. I have black. Not hard to find at all. Tons of people have this. This tape's basically like just to help you, um, like fix stuff. But whatever. And I have yellow. Not atomic yellow, okay? Not atomic yellow. This is sunburst yellow. So it's not atomic. It's pretty light. And if anyone wants to trade atomic yellow for this, sunburst yellow, I would love it. Or slash neon yellow, whatever you want to call it. And then, now, these colors, you can't really tell the difference, but right here is gray. This is not duck brand. But this color, I hate it. Now you have silver slash chrome slash silver coin. I love this tape, oh my, oh my. My good old days. So, yeah, you can order with that. All right, one sec. Now all my tapes are sort of getting lost, like my patterns. So I need to get all of these out of the bucket before oh, no! before um, they get buried and I have to dig through all of this again. All right, so I'm basically pulling all this stuff out right now. Now I have tons of tape on me, but whatever. Okay. So, just to stick with the theme right now, I have orange, as you can see right here. It's a nice orange. I like this color. It's pretty cool. I have maroon. This color, you don't really see a lot. I mean, not too many people like it. I think it's pretty cool. I mean, it was at least nice of them to make a tape like this. Because maroon, really nobody talks about. I like maroon, though. I love you, maroon. Okay? I love you. Now I have white. White, white, white. Very easy to find. Now I have cookie dough or beige, whatever you want to call it, tan. This color is nice. Doesn't match my tan at all. Matches my sister and my mom's tan, but not mine. So, yeah. I'm filming! Shut up! <sighs> then I have pink funky flamingo. Um, it probably looks orange, but... Now, moving on, I have all these tapes sticking all over me. And I would really enjoy to get them off so that I can move. Okay. Let me check what the video time is at. Okay? Okay. So. Nine minutes. And that was just some of the clothes. Okay. So then, next I have this. It is digital camo. Sorry about all these tapes. They're sort of just sitting here because I have nowhere else to put them. Whatever. So, I have digital camo. This tape has a really weird feel to it. And it's like real stretchy. And real sticky. This tape's pretty cool. And you have blue plaid. This color, seriously, is awesome. I love that color. Don't you? Then you have paint splatter. 
this color, now, the first time I saw this color, I literally wanted to freak out. I thought this color was so cool. But now, it's sort of lost its, like, rareness and its coolness. Everyone has it, but this color is pretty cool. I remember the good old days with this color. Rip paint splatter. This color is nice, but whatever. Then I have pink polka dot. Um, go you wear know, your wallet with this color. It's very nice. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. This color is awesome. Okay, now you have houndstooth. Now really, just look at this color when it's like being spent. Wait. Or like, look at that, look at that, look at that. Aw, sorry, I can't do it. Alright, whatever, but black and white houndstooth. Pretty cool. Now you have checkerboard. I don't know what to say. But, I do have one thing to say. I have one thing to say. Couldn't hear that. Then, I said, this is my favorite roll of tape. If anyone wants to make me a wallet of this for free, give me it. Then, you have leopard. Leopard. Leopard, leopard, leopard. Lots of people love this color. I have an ant leg on me. Because I killed an ant today. Okay. Then you have... Well, no, I'm going to save that to last. I'll stick with... This was one of their first designs Duck Brand has made. Um, it's totally tie-dye. It's basically purple, pink, red, blue, light blue, teal, whitish. I don't know. And it goes in the basket. And that's all the facts about it. Then moving on, you have these two tapes. I have two of them. It is Hello Kitty. One is unopened. One is very low. Hello Kitty. What can I say? What can I say? What can I say? You know what I can say? Nothing negative about this tape. This tape must have taken about a week for each tape to be made. I love this tape. I don't know why. And next you have plain old zebra print. Just black and white zebra. Then you have pink and black zebra. That's pretty nice, I think. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. And then you have the hot rod. Hot rod. Tapes are fun to play with. Okay, let me check what the time is at. Okay? Okay. Okay? Okay. Okay? Okay. Okay. Uh, okay, then. I get it. You love Hot Rod, okay? Okay, Ethan, I get it. You're a Hot Rod addict. Yeah, you stay there. Okay, so I have this Hot Rod tape. And next, I have the Cosmic Kai Kai. It's basically orange, red, yellow, pinkish colors. It's a tie-dye. And then, if you don't know, I live in Pennsylvania. Just like duct tape stuff, but he's in Florida now. Well, he's starting to live there, but he used to live in Pennsylvania. We have, like, all the rare tapes. Um, we're pretty epic. So, it's the Penn State Nittany Lions. And, um, if you're not from Pennsylvania, then this tape must look really cool to you. We see this symbol a lot. But it is from... College duct tape. That's the brand. Okay. And then next you have blue and 
white polka dot. It has little polka dots. I like this color. I know I do. No, I don't. No, I don't. Then you have real tree camo. This is not duck brand at all. It's like plasticky. Very smelly. Not sticky. I don't want to like this tape. And you have peace signs. Peace signs. It's a peace sign. No, that's stupid. Peace signs. Rainbow peace signs. And then you have. Rock tape. Da 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 da. This tape goes on and off. Duck brand. Just sell it. Just don't go on and off. I literally hate when they do this with tapes. But duck brand, if you're watching this, just send me some tape, some rock tape, please. Then you have my two. Of my favorite tapes. First you have skull tape. This tape, when it came out, it was the rarest tape. Now it's not, it's pretty much losing its rareness. Then you have dragons. Red with black dragons. Scale of 1 to 10. A 10. Duh. Okay, let me see what you guys are at because... I have a lot more to show you. I don't know if I want to, though. Okay. We're only at 16 minutes. That's not enough. So I just want to show you what, like, if you order, what your order thing will be coming in. Okay. So basically, if you order, your thing will come in this bubble mailer. There's bubble wrap in it. I just stick your stuff in there. And yeah, I just seal it up with some tape. And then I have different fabric feeling bubble mailers. The bubbles do not pop. Then I have another one. And another one that is not bubble mailer, but who cares? Because it doesn't really make a difference. You're not really going to get messed up in the mail. Okay. Then you have just some, like, newer pre-made wallets. I'm going to show you some of them. Like, there's some that I can't sell because, like, they're made by my friend. To me. So right now, I got a lot. And there is a pencil case. Oh, and this. Okay. So, you have this. It's going to end up as a Domo wallet. Brown. Whatever. Do you really care? No. This was made by my friend Nick. I know he's watching this. He probably stopped watching this far. But Nick, no offense. But the top's pretty uneven. And you could get an order. Like, if he sees your order, you could get him to make your wallet. But it doesn't matter. This is just a chrome old wallet. Very old, actually. Then you have this black, extremely old, humongous pocket. Then you have this white and green trifold. Not finished yet. But... What, what, whatever. Then you have this. No pockets. Um, you have this. Hello Kitty. Crap. Velcro bow. Then you have a green wallet. Pretty nice mustache wallet. I like it. You have this. It's sort of nice. I mean, it's okay. You have this, just yellow, sloppy old wallet. You have this, really nice. Um, rainbow trims, lime green billfold. That's a nice wallet. You have half this, half that. Nice ID border. 
pockets and that. So that's nice. Then you have this. It is my basic layout, but I added one extra pocket. Very nice plastic, by the way. Then I have this monster wallet. It, I made the monster logo small on purpose. I just felt like adding a border. These are very nice color combo. So that's nice. Then you have this pretty old checkered wallet. I have this random thing. Special. Nice. Then you have this Angry Birds wallet, which I won't sell. Okay. Now I don't really want to get delayed because I don't know how long I'm allowed to make this video. But then you have my super strong magnets. So that's pretty nice. Uh, and then you have my ID plastic. Nice small. Okay. So you have that. Oopsie. Drop that one. Um... You have my Velcro, my X-Acto knife. Here's what a bracelet looks like. Okay, and now the moment you all have been waiting for. I may have told you this. Um, if you go to my channel and you read it, the top of my channel says 200 subscribers for world's biggest tape ball. Out of 100% duct tape. Now, if you're wondering, oh, it's not going to be too big, he's just going to say that to get subscribers. I'm not kidding. So, people have been saying, oh, I'm unsubscribing, you're not going to give us the biggest tape ball. Do you seriously want to see it? I think you do. I'm not even at 100 yet, and I'm already at this. That's very nice. And then, also in my area, I have this pencil case. Which will not be used for school. I wish I could, but it's not big enough, unfortunately. Sadly, I mean. Then you have this. It's basically a painting with all my crap on it. All my tape colors. Well, at least most of them. So, yeah. I'm just going to check what the time is at. It's at 22 minutes. So... I just want to thank you, if you're watching this, all the way to this time, I really appreciate it. Like, I can't even describe how much I appreciate it. So now he's going to get hit by this ball.